beautiful people, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Po and welcome to this new video. If you are a new subscriber and a new follower and this is your first time clicking on my videos, hello, my name is Poya Sec and welcome. If you're already a follower and a subscriber, hello bro, hello sis, how are you doing today? For today's video, I have an unboxing for the first time on my channel, so if you would like to see or stay tuned to see what I have in this box, then continue watching. incorporate new things on my channel this year so that we can continue to grow and not always do the same things but let's go ahead and get started as you can see on my title of this video I'm doing an unboxing for my new Marc Jacobs bag I'm super excited because I'm not really well I am a fashion person I love to shop I love to get new things but when it comes to bags I don't really splurge that much on bags so this one was one that I really saw in person and I was like I have to get it like I have to so the first time I saw this bag right I saw it on some girl in Austin Texas while I was working on a shoot I just saw her and I was like I really like that bag I really love the structure and everything and then when I saw just I just kept seeing people wearing this bag and I was like okay I need this bag not because I'm not somebody who will go get a bag because everyone has it but I love tote bags and you guys see from the title that I got the Marc Jacobs tote bag and tote bags are my thing and I'm going to explain to you why. I'm going to show you guys, uh, these are the tote bags I was initially wearing. This is my gym bag, like it has all my gym stuff in here. I love this tote bag, I got them from Cotton On um, and this one says take care of the earth it says rest and relaxation be kind to your mind and i love tote bags just because a lot of them have like those messages on them that are super cute i'm just trying to show you guys that i love tote bags i love the cotton i love the long straps i love how there's a lot of space just to put stuff in here um no matter where you're going you just have a lot of space in a tote bag so that is why i had to go ahead and get the mark jacobs tote bag so let's just start with the unboxing and i'll explain to you guys like why i got it <laughs> i got this box in yesterday on january 19th it was a wednesday and when i ordered this bag it was the wednesday before or the thursday before so it didn't take too long for it to get here but i haven't opened the box yet as you can see it's like sealed because i wanted to do the unboxing in front of you guys this Okay, so this is the box after opening it. It says Marc Jacobs, of course, and the bag is in there in a nicely packed plastic, you know, just to make sure it's cute. Okay, so took that out the plastic. This is my bag, y'all. Oh my gosh, she's so cute. This is my first time seeing her in person, up close, being able to touch her. Cause you know, I don't go to other people's bags and you know, I'm looking at them and I touch them, no. I don't, don't touch another woman's bag, period. So yeah, this is my first time actually having it in hand on like, you know, captions on bags like this. But like I said, all the other tote bags have like messages on them. So I'm pretty used to that. Um, and this says the tote bag, Marc Jacobs. And at the back, it says the Marc Jacobs style tote bag location NYC year 1984. First, one of the main reasons why I really like it is it still has that cotton material vibe, which I really like. And the reason why I like the cotton material is because if you spill anything on this or anything, it's just going to be easier to wash it out and make sure that there aren't any stains. So I really like that. Um, with leather or with any kind of bag, I have seen over time, you know, it does get dirty if you wear it every day like I 
wear my bath so they do get a little dirty so it's understanding how to clean them how to take care of them so they can look new all the way through but um, I love this this cotton um, now for this tote bag as you can see it doesn't have the long strands as like the normal tote bags that I showed you in the beginning but I really love I just, I still love the handle. I don't know why, I still really like it. So I'm gonna go ahead and just open it because like, but as soon as I cut that open, there's a zipper, which I really love because I kind of get frustrated when bags only have like that little button to click on the top. And y'all know damn well that us girls, we have way too much to put in our purse. We have a wallet, we have lip gloss, we got our phones, we have other things that we have to put in our bags and sometimes that little click doesn't do much so i really love that this has a zipper also for women like we understand that you know um there are a lot of thieves out there and women are still a target especially when we have bags so it just it makes me feel so much better that there is a shorter strap for me to have like girth and hold to my bag and at the same time if i'm walking around i can zip it and close it without you know feeling like people can look inside of my bag that they can grab things out of the bag because a tote bag in general is gonna have a lot of space a lot of openness so you can just go in and go out but that also gives people the freedom to do the same thing so <laughs> um this gives us a little bit more control yeah so, oh, it comes with straps. I didn't know it came with straps because online I saw that they have different straps, like different styles that you could purchase, but I didn't know they gave you one. Okay, thanks, Mark. So, yeah, inside the bag, you know, there's the tag for Mark Jacobs. And you know, there's space in here. Like this is a traveling bag. Like you can travel, you can do stuff with it. Use for a day out when I need to put a lot of things in here. You know, if I'm going to a friend's house for the day, this this is like good enough, you know? Um, let's see. Ooh. They do give you a little zipper part on the side. You know, ladies, we love our extra zippers on the side inside and then there are two pockets so this bag is going to allow you to really carry all the things that you need not only ladies i know there are my fellows out there that also wear bags just know that this has enough space for you know the everyday travel i know some people who could use this bag as like their overnight bag so yeah mark jacobs lining and all those things so this is the part where the zipper and the pockets are in you can even flap that up maybe to make more space in the bag for you and you can also just flatten it here yeah um the other day like after i had already ordered the bag i was like i'm not about to go purchase again um i saw that they had different straps for these bags and they come in different designs different colors some of them have like the bold, like you know, Mark Jacobs, um, like name font on it. But this one, oh, I, I really. This one is like a black, basic, not basic, like she's basic, but like you know, it has no writing on it. It's just black, and that is kind of what I like. I don't really so. You can wear it like this, or you can wear it with the hands. So, fellas, ladies, this is really giving you like the versatility of holding your bag, how you carry it. So yeah, this is how you would wear it, you know? Like I said, you can carry like this. Sometimes I like to carry myself if I have a lot of things in here. And then, you know, sometimes, you know, we like to carry it like this. So I was just giving you guys a lot of the visuals of this bag so you guys can see it. Structure, structure, structure. That is honestly why I got this bag. It doesn't, like, I love the khaki style. I love this. I love the vibe of this bag. I love about 
this tote bag and why I had to get it, you know, in comparison to tote bags like this is the structure. Like this one is heavier. It has the nice box um, detail. I love boxy things. Like, I don't know. I don't know why I like boxy things. Like I love even blazers that make my shoulder look boxy. But anyways, I don't I just love the boxy look and the structure. It's the structure for me, honestly. It's the structure for me. So, so small quick info on the bag. So, this is the Marc Jacobs tote bag in the size small, and this one is in the color slate green. Um, I know it could look like beige. It could look like whatever, but this is in the color slate green. When I saw online, there was black, a uh, cream color, this color, and a blue, like a navy blue color, kind of like denim jeans, kind of. But yeah, I really, I'm, I'm, y'all know that green has been talking to me a lot, so I went ahead and got this color. So that bag costs one seventy five online. You will see that the small tote bag is one hundred and seventy five dollars. I think the next one is one hundred and ninety five. I have to check. These are the four colors that they have online um, for this specific collection. They have another. They have the same bag, but in one size a little bit bigger. And that one is $195. And I think that bag would be best for people who are looking for a bag they could travel in, um, like an overnight bag, like, oh, you know, just stuff to pack things in. It's gonna give you a lot of space. And then they have a lot of these other, like, color blocking bags that have two colors that contrast with each other. And then they also have the creature, which has, like, kind of looking on it they also have the leather tote bags which I'm planning to get because talk about it I'm really feeling this tote bag for my next purchase from Marc Jacobs it's the same style but it's leather instead of cotton and the say that is because in the beginning when I was looking to purchase this bag obviously I did my research just to see how people felt about it after like a couple of months of owning the bag and a lot of people did say that um, the more and more that they wore this bag, the bag's structure kind of starts to fumble. <laughs> like, because when you put a lot of stuff in here, there's still structure, but the bag is still going to, like, be a tote bag. You know what I mean? And another thing, which was a really big con for me, was that people said that um, because of the cotton texture and the cotton material, not the cotton texture, the cotton material, that if you have dust bunnies in your house or you wear a lot of material that has cotton and things that come off of it, it gets stuck to the toe bag. So I'm pretty sure Marc Jacobs, like the company and the designers knew, cause I'm pretty sure they own like a bag before selling it or during the process of selling it and one thing that they could have done from seeing like other people's videos guys one girl had like you know like material from her other clothing on her bag and her bag was like beige so you could really see it and it's like these tote bags that i have i can see you know some stuff getting stuck to the cotton so one thing i would have recommended to mark jacobs was to sell the bag with a cover bag just the way telfer has one hold on these cover bags like this one came for my smaller telfer bag and then this one came from my medium sized telfer bag um my my telfer bags i store them like on a hanger so that they can just hang together, be away from things. Um, like, I don't really need to cover them that much. But for this bag, from seeing what people were seeing from, you know, people saying that, like, things get stuck to this over time, I'm basically going to be using my Telfer Medium cover bag to cover this bag because... So... 
you know, I think it's a good purchase. I'm really happy with what I have. If you guys enjoyed my review. Like I said, I did a lot of my own research before I bought this bag. Before I buy anything that's, I feel like, over... You know what? Anytime that I'm spending money on anything, period, I do my research on it. And, um... I hope that you do your own research on it as well. I feel like I gave you guys enough information in this video. So if you're thinking about getting this bag, I would definitely recommend it. I would definitely, you know, look at it. Maybe go into the store, like a Marc Jacobs store and see, look at this bag, look at it in person, see what you like. Look at the different sizes to see which one matches you. But um, I'm also not sponsored by Marc Jacobs, so like, what am I doing? But anyways, I love bags, I love fashion, I'm a model, so I just want to share what I got. But anyways, that is the end of the video. If you guys enjoyed this video, leave me a thumbs up, comments, let me know what you think about this video, let me know what you think about the bag, tell me if you're thinking about getting the bag, because if you are, go get it, go get it. I love this bag, but anyway um leave a comment thumbs up subscribe share new things this year so we're we're gonna do it all right but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video and until the next time you guys stay blessed and i will see you soon let me know